Joy said this in an interview given to the Indian media NDTV from Washington DC, USA, a few days after the resignation and departure of Sheikh Hasina in the face of mass protests. He said his mother does not want to live abroad. He wants to return to Bangladesh. According to an NDTV report, Joy insisted in the interview that Sheikh Hasina wanted to retire during the last two terms of her prime ministership. However, he did not rule out the possibility of his mother returning to active politics. Sajidway's Joy said, I spoke to her, Sheikh Hasina, yesterday, Thursday, night. He has no plans as of now. He is in one place. There is no truth in the speculations that are going on about visa or political asylum application. Joy also said that what Shia Sheikh Hasina wants is to go back to Bangladesh. It may be to return to politics or it may be for retirement. This is his country. He grew up there. This would have been his last term, he was 76 years old. He wants to spend his retirement at his village home in Tunjibra. This is his dream. He does not want to spend his retirement anywhere outside Bangladesh. In response to the question whether Sheikh Hasina will return to active politics or not, Joy said, she is Sheikh Hasina, can answer this question well. Joy claimed that her mother did politics for the country and not for power. Joy said, he wanted to retire in the last two terms. Even before every election he insisted me to come back and join politics. No one in our family was ambitious for power or politics. In response to the question whether he wants to lead the team now or not, Joy said, I think, now I have already become that. I never wanted it. I have no political ambitions. But whenever I came to know, our party leaders were being attacked, their houses were being burnt. I said, I can't let go of their hands. Sheikh Hasina's former technology advisor Joy said, I am in touch with many leaders of my party. Almost all the houses of our ministers have been burnt. Our ancestral house was also burnt. I will do what is necessary in this situation. Awami League still has millions of followers, they cannot disappear overnight.